Hi everyone, my name is Aika Torres. I'm the graduate assistant at the Career Development Center here at UIS, and I'm joined by my colleague, Kristen. Hello everyone, my name is Kristen Nisbet-White. I am the Employer Development and Informatics Liaison in the Career Development Center and happy to be with you today. Thanks so much for joining us today. We are joined by Tammy from BPI. Um, we will be joining here uh, just to talk about your organization and talk about, you know, what drew you to your organization and, you know, get to know you. And um, I'd love for you to share more about you and yourself and talk more to the students about your organization. So by all means, introduce yourself and please share what drew you to your job. Absolutely, absolutely. So I'm Tammy here at Behavioral Perspective. I am the Talent Acquisition Manager. And I actually started with the company about five years ago um, as a behavior technician on the clinical side, working directly with our learners that we serve. And what attracted me to this company was simply that I was looking for a place where I could make a difference, where I could work with families, um, individuals with autism, and help them reach their goals. Awesome, thanks. Can you tell us a unique or a fun fact about your organization? Sure. So a fun fact about behavioral perspective, we are BCBA owned, which is board certified behavior analyst. The founder and CEO of BPI has a master's degree in ABA, which is unique to ABA companies. So our founder knows firsthand what we are doing for the children and teens that we're serving. We started in, the company opened in 2010, and for the first five years or so, it was only in-home therapy. And then around 2014, end of 2014, our first location opened up in Aurora, Illinois. And now uh, six, seven-ish years later, we have nine different locations. The company also started only with applied behavior analysis, ABA therapy. And we now have branched out to also providing occupational therapy and speech therapy to the, our clients as well. Great, thanks. Um, can you tell us a little bit more about, you know, what kind of positions are available at your organization? Absolutely. So um, we have a few different positions that do require a license. We have occupational therapists, speech therapists, and board certified behavior analysts. But then we do also have an entry level position, which is the behavior technician. So the only requirement for that position is to have a high school diploma or the equivalent, as well as a passion to help others. That's simply all we're really looking for. And we will train our staff for success if they don't have that previous experience. And then as a behavior technician, we also put them through training to become a registered behavior technician, which is, stands for our VT. What are some of the most important skills or characteristics needed to succeed in this organization? So you always, you already talked about that a little bit with the desire to help others, but can you elaborate on that a little bit more? Absolutely, absolutely. And that is such a great question, one that I get so frequently because it's not so much the skills that we're looking at. It's fantastic if the individual already has experience working with children or teens or individuals with autism, but more specifically, the traits or characteristics we're looking for is that passion, that empathy, understanding for these individuals that have a disability. We're also looking for that commitment, dedication to these children and their families. And then perseverance is huge. This is a challenging role, but at the same time, it's very rewarding. So we're looking for people that are really looking simply for a rewarding position, someone that can also have a creative mindset, can think outside the box and find those unique ways to make those connections with our learners. Thank you. Um, lastly, what would, how would you describe your organization's workplace culture? And I guess to go more in depth with that, uh, what would you like potential applicants to know about the day-to-day -day operations, the workflow within your environment, things like that? Absolutely. So I think uh, the culture really is centered around what our values are. So collaboration, integrity, positivity, and creativity. Uh, that's what we're looking for in our employees. And that's the kind of environment that we're trying to create, especially that positive environment. We need someone that can come in each day, create a positive environment, have a positive mindset, 
And that makes such a difference for our coworkers, the clients that we're serving, that energy really is contagious. So that's the type of environment that we're trying to create. So that's gonna benefit our clients as well. In regards to the day-to-day, -day, it is a fast-paced environment. Working with children with autism, um, they are going to keep you active. They're looking for um, that energy, someone who's energetic and excited about this, someone can keep up with that fast-paced environment. Um, like I mentioned before, it's a challenging position, but it's an incredible experience. So we need people also who are lifelong learners. You're going to learn so much from this position. Um, you're going to create such incredible experiences, be able to grow. Um, so we're really, um, really a benefit to anyone who is any wants to be in a human service field, wants to work with children, individuals with disabilities, if you want to work in a hospital, in a classroom. Um, it's just someone who has that mindset of a fast paced environment, and just really, really excited to come to work every day and make a difference. Thank you so much. Is there anything else that you want to share before we wrap up? I think that's it. Just really summing it up. Um, as I mentioned, all of these things, it's such an incredible experience for anyone at any point in their life, out of high school, in college, post-college, still trying to figure out what they want to go to school for. It's one, it's such a great experience. And then two, you get to know firsthand that you are making a difference in people's lives. Absolutely. I agree with that wholeheartedly. Well, thank you so much for joining us today. Thank you. I appreciate you guys having me. Excited to tell you more about BPI. Awesome. We appreciate your presence. Thanks again.